pruning okay what is vtp pruning we just little bit discuss in the ccna level but maybe you forgot either i didn't teach you i don't know okay what is vtp pruning in this case suppose we have three switches here we have uh, vlan 1020 here have we also vlan 1020 suppose vlan 10 and 20 the same is here let me duplicate 1020 is here and 1020 is here okay but one thing more they all have vtp on yeah. they are distributing vlans and everything is enable and everything okay okay suppose this pc is connected to vlan 10 here pc is connected to vlan 20 and there is nothing to connect it vlan 10 and 20 okay now what will happen by default if vlan 10 is sending packet it will go here and here as well because they are the same domain same domain vlan yeah if you are not sure i can show you the old topology we discuss in ccna uh here is let me go here and that was a blank vtp or something are we then blank or empty let me check if you remember this if we create vlans vlan uh, it 10 and 20 if this one broadcast so it will come here it, if i broadcast it will come here and here and here and here and here okay but if these pcs are not attached suppose in vlan 10 again they will send here because these two vlan 10 is configured there they will send by any means they will say okay because vlan 10 is configured vlan 10 is configured vlan 10 is here configured i will broadcast within the vlan 10 yeah. so the packet will go here as well here here sorry okay and here as well yeah. so for this purpose we need a technology if nobody is attached vlan 10 and yeah. switch 3 uh, so the packet uh, do not need to go there yeah. it is called vtp pruning yeah. to stop the broadcast to minimize the band bend yeah. yeah to make them more efficient we need vtp pruning and how we can configure them just come here in the configuration and okay by default is off if i say show vtp status so its pruning is by default disable the other thing you didn't need to go to every switch and make them enable just in which switch in the server server primary okay. server it's disable here how to just vtp pruning yes is on and let them check let me clear and check show show vtp status it say vtp pruning is enabled now and it will enable yeah. switch to all three yes of course if i come here and check them show vtp status it say oh it's not come here either no it was not transparent this client this was client yes. maybe it will take some time let me check here as well because this one is transparent but i need to check them here as well show vtp status is disable here but has and this one has to be enabled automatically show vtp status maybe it take some time let me make them myself it will set them some time but i don't think so i can do it or not yeah, i can do it okay but it will do automatically yeah, yeah. if you check them by default in the real switches here i will face some problem because this is simulation hmm. so whatever say it is fix i know <clears throat> okay now pruning is enable what will happen if pruning is enable and there is no pc belong to 10 and 20 the packet will come up to this point only yeah. okay 
up to this yeah. they will say i don't need to send them there the reason uh -huh. is there is no 20 and 20 yeah. belong to it okay? yeah. so it will not go there this is the best practices of vtp pruning suppose uh, like in the uh, packet process we are sending the simulation or no in the gms no the is, you have to capture the packet to check them like this uh, in the real yeah. environment like should we learn brief let me let me try something to at least it's uh, sure to you here we have we learn 20 30 40 50 60 and 70 okay and so we learn brief yeah 20 30 40 60 70 yes i can do another step okay to show you because in simulation we can show you over here show interface trunk they say the interface trunk say i can take the packet for, for 1 20 30 40 50 60 70 100 300 and 1107 and here show interface trunk again for the same things okay Mm, no, it hasn't to show like this. Let me create them again. Let me clear to you, okay? Okay, let me clear this. Discard. Cancel. And let me to switch quickly one and two. two. Okay, and I don't need any PC zero zero is they both are connected. Okay, and let me change house name SW one SW two. Okay, and make them on. Okay, let me go to switch one and follow all the condition which say for the VTP origin config T interface it's 0 slash 0 switch port trunk encapsulation dot 1 Q switch port mode trunk the other side will automatically trunk okay the other thing we need VTP VTP domain test it will go automatically there as well so I don't because I have two systems only if I check them so I have trunk and I don't need the password show VTP status yeah it's test and, and the trunk is let me check the trunk as well show interface trunk yeah it's trunk okay I have pulled the condition now okay at the moment none of the VLAN is passing because there is let me create one VLAN VLAN 10 okay and it will come here automatically and it will add here VLAN 1 and has to show the VLAN okay because we, they have to show here the VLAN 10 as well maybe let me come out the here to it will show it has to show the 10 yeah it's yeah, added now yeah. it say I can take the traffic power VLAN 1 and 10 yeah, yeah. okay because we have two VLAN 1 and 10 both side is it clear yeah. here show interface trunk they can say i can take data for one and ten okay, okay. now nobody is attached here with vlan 10 okay Not only these are attached they have their trunk okay now what to do let me on the trunking uh, sorry the vtp okay. proning okay what is the VTP command vtp proning okay and here it will come automatically VTP status it's enable automatically and the last it was not so now it's clear now enable okay and here is also enable okay now show interface trunk here only show one yeah there is no 10 no 10 Pruning yeah. is enabled. It has to show me the 10 as well. Yeah. Because the other one is nobody has attached with the VLAN 10. Yeah. To, 
so it's prone them prone means don't send them anything now how it the 10 will here come if somebody attach here and they switch with vlan 10 so let me attach somebody config t interface vlan 10 vlan 10 there are okay no shutdown and let me assign them ip suppose 1.1 it's like a uh, attach somebody 255.0.0.0 okay at the moment it's here i will prune yeah? it's written is zero, zero because this interface is strong i will only take and only take data for vlan 1 yeah. because somebody is attached there all yeah. the ports are by default attached in vlan 1 but nobody is attached with vlan yeah. 10 yeah. we have a vlan 10 but i will not take the data issue here yeah? all the vlans but it's not showing here the reason is nobody attached with vlan 10 yeah. and i enable pruning yeah. now somebody is attached I have given the IP and make them up. Let's check here again. If there is a VLAN 10, it and means we are true. Yeah. yeah. Look at now. Yeah. There is a VLAN 1 yeah, now. Yeah. Now they have VLAN yeah. 10. Yeah. Because somebody attached there. So they will say, now I will keep the data, send the data there. Yeah. But if there is nobody attached VLAN 10, I will remove this. If I shut down this interface, mm -hmm. Nobody is attached with VLAN 10. So you will say no, you don't need. For some time it will be here. Okay. It will yeah. take 50 seconds. And it will remove. Let me wait. I don't want to try again and again. Now it will yeah. remove. Because nobody is attached, attached with VLAN, VLAN 10. VLAN. So it's called pony. It just save your bandwidth and yeah. you know, unnecessary traffic. It will stop the unnecessary traffic. Look at now. Yeah. It's yeah. gone. Because they say after 50 seconds, because it's spanning tree as well. So after 50 seconds, they check out. Okay, there is no 10. 10 is configured, but nobody is attached. So I don't want to send data. It will remove from the list. But before it was here. Yeah. Clear is? Yeah. So it is called VTP, VTP. proning. Okay. So it's clear. And 